And this is just the first stop on the list of many stops that you'll be having um, throughout this upcoming week. What are some other cities that you'll be hitting on? Uh, so after this, we're going to be uh, in New Orleans, and then we're going to go up to Jackson, Mississippi, Tallahassee, and down the Marathon and the Florida Keys. All places very susceptible for hurricanes. But where you're born and raised, not exactly the case. No, I'm originally from Ohio, so uh, flying hurricanes uh, was never on my radar. As a child, I've always wanted to fly, so I'm here, I'm making it happen, but uh, it is an absolute blessing and honor to uh, fly with this unit. An exciting job to say uh, the least, uh, but let's go ahead and talk about the importance of the information that you gather out there. How do we use that back in the States? Okay, so we go out into the hurricane and release the drop signs and gather all the data to uh, fine tune that forecast um, and all that data is sent from the plane to the National Hurricane Center and then you guys are uh, seeing the updated track and uh, getting that information that uh, the population needs. And we were talking about this earlier, the very iconic path that you take in a hurricane. It, it matters those points that you have to hit every single one of them to get the accurate data. Uh, what is that very iconic path? Okay, so that's what we call a uh, an alpha pattern that we will fly. So we want to hit all the different quadrants of the storm so we can get the full picture and the data. And we'll basically make giant triangles in the sky and always making left-hand turns. So we will uh, hit the center of the hurricane usually about four or five times every mission. All right, and you drop those little drop signs, get that information back, and that's what we use to help uh, perfect the forecast for hurricanes to come. Now let's go ahead and talk about the information that you need to know before you leave the house and come out to this event today. There are signs showing you where to park, how to get here once you arrive to Ellington Airport. It's only going from 12.30 to 4. Take the kids out. Take the family out. Let them ask the questions. And you need to gather the information that you need to prepare for the upcoming hurricane season. All of this is happening for free. So there's no reason why you shouldn't come out here if you have the time. You're watching CW39 Houston. No wait weather and traffic. Sharon, back to you.